Hi, today we're going to be talking about absolute values. Let's get started. So an absolute value measures how far a number is from zero. So that's the definition. So the absolute value sign is these bars. So for example, the absolute value of 5 is denoted by bar 5 bar right there. Let's see, let's look at this tip, which says that an absolute value is always positive. Remember that, this is very important. It's always positive. Now let's look at an example. So we're trying to find the absolute value of negative 2. So we need to find how far away negative 2 is from 0. So we hop. We have, we're one spot away, we're two spot away. So one, two. So the absolute value of negative two is equal to two. Now let's do the same thing and find the absolute value for two. In this case, we hop one, hop two, one, two. And again, the answer is two. So the absolute value of two is equal to two. So did you realize that neg the absolute value of negative 2 and 2 and the absolute value of 2 are the same? So, in a conclusion, if a number is negative, then the absolute value is the opposite of the number. So like negative 2, the absolute value of negative 2 was the opposite of negative 2, which is 2. If a number is non-negative, meaning if it's 0 or it's a positive integer, then the absolute value is the number itself. So for example, the absolute value of 0 is 0, and the absolute value of 3 would be 3. I hope that helped, and I hope to see you soon.